here. Welcome to the fourth episode of my spring trend lookbook for 2012 as well as 2013. One trend that is definitely transferring from spring this year to spring next year is metallic. I'm going to show you five different looks that I put together um, incorporating different metallic items into my outfits. From what I've seen on runway, metallic is shown in either a bronzy colour or gold. Most of my looks are gold or bronze. However, I did want to include one silver outfit, so that's what I did. I think this first look is perfect for work, mainly because the metallic item in this look is a blazer. I think if you don't want to go full blown with a full metallic outfit and you only want to wear one metallic piece, I think the key to rocking that outfit is to keep the rest of your outfit really minimal. That's why I chose a white long sleeve shirt and beige long pants and I wanted to add a fun accessory so I went with this bangle and I went with some sparkly gold slingback heels. I think this look is definitely a casual way to wear metallic. This jacket I have worn on a night out but I wanted to wear it in a casual way so I went with a black shirt and some simple blue skinny jeans from Target. I think this top is really cool basically because of all the, the detail up the top and the collar. And to keep the look really simple and casual, I went with some black ballet flats. This third outfit I nicknamed Goldfinger just because of this fabulous gold jacket that was actually gifted to me by my grandmother. I really, really love this jacket. Um, I couldn't find a way to wear it casually, so I decided to pair it with all black to keep all the focus on the jacket. And I would definitely wear this out on the town. I kept it simple with a black shirt, black pants, and I wanted to accessorize, so I went with some gold chain necklaces. And to keep along with the black theme of the outfit, I went with my black heels. This is my silver metallic look. I went with this really cute sparkly cardigan and underneath I wore this grey shiny ombre top. I love the little bow on the back of the cardigan, I think it's really really cute and adds a bit of a feminine touch. I kept all the focus on my top half so I went with some black three quarter pants and to keep up with the silver theme I went with my silver heels. This last look is definitely not for everybody and I was a bit skeptical when I bought this body chain because I didn't know how to wear it. But I think the key to a body chain is to keep the rest of your outfit extremely simple. So I went with a white dress and a white lace skirt underneath for added length. And what I love about this body chain is that it's not joined, I can actually separate the chains and just wear them as necklaces which I thought was cool. And to keep up with the edgy look of the chain, I went with my brown leaders. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!